but here it is we got the boss equalizer gb7 as modded by analog man if you're in the market for a eq pedal i would definitely recommend this one the geb7 by itself is a really solidly built pedal it's fairly straightforward i like products that boss makes and so i went straight for it when i knew that i was looking for an eq pedal the only thing that i did not like about the geb7 in its stock form is the hiss that i was getting when it was activated the on signal just had an inherent hiss and it was a uh, pretty annoying i use my equalizer in my signal chain that incorporates my swells and so it's something that i use mostly in or a lot in quieter settings on stage where almost my swells can a lot of times be the only thing that's happening at the time on stage as far as music being produced and with that hiss that was coming out of course it was it was pretty noticeable you know if you're just looking to put an eq on it to just rock out then the hiss probably won't bother you as much but for me it was very very noticeable and it was almost like nails on a chalkboard in those moments where it was pretty quiet and i was having swells uh, coming from my board with just that hiss every time I push the volume pedal all the way down you could just get it in there as soon as you activated that that signal chain with the swells there was just a significant increase in the hiss so what I did is um, I actually took my GB7 and I sent it out to Analog Man they replaced a lot of the internal parts with much higher quality parts and one also cool thing they did which might even be my favorite part about it is they swapped out the LED it's actually green now instead of red so a little visual indicator that she's been souped up as far as EQ pedals go it's as simple as they come you've got you got 50 Hertz 120 400 500 800 4.5 K and 10 K then you've got a volume level I do like the volume level and it kinda gives this pedal a secondary use if you're having trouble getting gain from your bass or if you need more gain or if you need to cut it back uh, you can easily use this you can just give it a little bit more volume and uh, whenever you activate the pedal boom you've got more volume you can set it to a flat EQ and that way all you're doing is changing the volume or you can have the EQ and the volume boost or volume cut all in one and there you go two functions in one the reason I use this pedal is because I have two separate signal chains one for my bass sound and one for my swells I send a flat EQ from my bass through a compressor the CS3 there's I have another video of a demo and review of that as upgraded by Humphrey Audio uh, I go through the CS3 into the volume pedal into an AB selector switch which splits my channels and the bass goes through a sans amp which I have a review of that uh, in another video as well and then the so by the time my tone for the swells hits the AB selector it actually doesn't have any high mid or low cut or boost anything affecting the tone because I have a flat EQ on the bass so the GB7 is the one and only thing in my swell signal chain which will mo modify the tone so I use it to boost the mids up, get a little more, get, get a little bit more clarity, and uh, it also helps it cut through the mix when I'm swelling. In this channel, I also use the Dispatch Master, which I'll do a review on, and I have a delay, uh, the Nova delay, which I've got on there. And um, here I'll let you hear this chain, the signal chain, real quick, um, with the GEB7 off, and then with it on. So here's a couple swells. Hopefully you could tell just right there in those two comparisons that with the GEB7 on, it with that with that mid boost it gives a little bit of a of a grit uh, that kind of cuts through, and it kind of gives it more of a clear 
droning swell and I just like the way that sounds better than without it. So I definitely have a good use for it. Definitely recommend this pedal. If you are going to get the GEB7, I would recommend to get it modified either by Analog Man or your favorite uh, pedal guru if you buy a, a mod kit. So there you go. Check out the other videos I have of my other pedals. And um, happy bass playing. Thanks a lot.